Shut up and sit down. Hi, I'm Mona Seeberger. I'm a pilot, instructor and a technician. Unintended flight into IMC is one of the most frequent causes of helicopter accidents. This video is the third of the series in flying unintended into IMC. In it, I want to cover the actions you can take to recover from unintended IMC. Firstly, you should know what being in IMC looks and feels like. If you are in IMC, you lack proper visibility, lack visual references to the horizon, and won't be able to control the helicopter using external visual cues. Things will feel very uncomfortable very quickly. So it is important to stay calm and act with purpose. To survive an unintended IMC situation, admit to yourself that you are an IMC. Commit to the instrument flying to maintain speed and attitude. Maintain your composure and full control over the helicopter. Execute a recovery to get out of the situation. The type of recovery will depend on many factors include the helicopter you are flying, the location, altitude and other factors. There is more guidance on the recovery available in the VAST, ESBNR and ICHES safety promotion material. Finally, contact ATC and declare an emergency so they can guide you and help you to avoid other weather, traffic, terrain and obstacles. And remember, aviate, navigate and communicate in that order. The key points are, know what IMC looks and feels like. Accept you are an IMC, then a perform a recovery to get out of the situation. Aviate, navigate, communicate, in that order. And have a safe flight! <laughs>